Long time no see. <sighs> what brings you back here? Well, we need to find a way to get topside as quickly as possible. And we figured Corneo ought to know one. <sighs> Is that so? In that case, I can help. You serious? Then tell us! Follow me. Hmm. Let's just hear him out. So, what's the deal with the hole? Unfinished business. If you three give me a hand with it, I'll give you what you need to get topside. You want us to go back into the sewers with you? What's down there? Corneo's hidey hole. That's where I'm headed. You're not gonna try to screw us over, are you? If that's what you think, walk away. I'll find somebody else to work with. And you'll have to find another way to get topside. All right. We're in. Say what? He betrays us. He dies. Fine by me. He means it. I'll tell you more after we've climbed down. When you're good to go, let me know. You guys ready? Okay. Follow me. Seriously, what's the deal with the hole? It's a trap for the Don's enemies. What? No one's ever gotten out alive. Well, until recently, that is. You are gonna hold up your end of the bargain, right? Long as you hold up yours, yeah. I don't trust you and I don't like you. So if you so much as breathe in a suspicious way, I'll turn that face of yours into a honeycomb. I'd save your bullets for the monsters if I were you. Some are a lot tougher than you'd think. Hate to say it, but I can barely take them on my own. You, on the other hand, shouldn't have any trouble, am I right? Let's get this over with. Head for the trunk line. It marks the border with Sector 7. You three lead the way. I'll follow a short distance behind. The Mark of Avalanche. Right. Jesse and Big stashed the skeleton key down here. I never got the chance to thank them for what they did. Tifa. Let's just keep moving, okay? Hate to interrupt, but the trunk line's just through that door. The one over there? Yeah, we heard you. Made it. About time. <sighs> this way. There should be a door with Corneo's mark on it around here somewhere. Hey, wasn't this locked before? Your time to shine. Clear the path ahead, would you? Yeah, yeah. Can I ask you something? Why did you help us out before? You could have lost everything. Andrea, he told me to. That really it? And I couldn't bring myself to let it happen again. Huh? It doesn't matter. Let's go.
seriously. Now you're in for it. Wait. We're getting close to Corneo's hideout. From here on, I'll take the lead. This it? Yeah. So how are we supposed to get topside? Through here. Then you're telling me we're not done? Sorry guys, but it's not that simple. No! Wait! We gotta catch him! Huh? He took the key to the door! Without it, we're screwed! Let's go. Where in the hell did that thing run off to? Oh. As if this wasn't enough fun already. Here you up ahead. It's that thing's den. Keep your eyes peeled. You never know when its friends are gonna pop up. Or where. Here I go. Right behind you. <laughs> Got you now. So, gonna make us work for it, are you? I'm not gonna hurt you, little fella. So just stay. <sighs> Maybe dial it back a little. Take the right. I'm on it. Your days are numbered, rat boy. Just like his owner. Give it back! <laughs> Give it back! Give it back. That's not a key. Sorry. That's not your pendant either. Were they family? No. It was all just a dream, wasn't it? But one day? No. Time to wake up and forget. Six months ago. On that day, Corneo picked her as a bride, and on the next, she vanished without a trace. But before she did, she gave it back. Salt on the wound. Thing cost me a small fortune. Why did you want to come down here? Revenge. I know I need to let go, but I can't. I need closure, because without it, I'll never be able to move on. It's fine. As long as you get us topside, we're still in. Thanks. And don't worry. I got you. <sighs> you all right. I know a shortcut. <laughs> 